Ferguson called. Uh, the same way we end up representing most of the people that we end up representing, they he contacted us. We laid out a strategy, a course of action uh, for him, which involved his only conceivable defense in this case, which was the insanity defense. And Kunstler couched it in, in, with the phrase black rage. And once that phrase was used, it created a tremendous amount of rage in the white community. What, did I suppress this guy? Did we suppress him? I didn't do a damn thing, I didn't know him. Why didn't he go on a train to Brooklyn? Why did he come on a train to Garden City? Predominantly white people. Today in question, the entire file spilled in the back seat of the vehicle, and I think this is totally unacceptable. You also were here at nine o'clock this morning and had up in about two and a half hours to rearrange the work. And as I understand it, you did absolutely nothing during that period of time while you were in the detention cell. Judge, I at do this not... Point, at this point, to, to say you, that you need more time is absurd to the court. The fact that Colin Ferguson was a ticking time bomb was apparent to everyone who had come into contact with him. He dealt with Adelphi University. He became um, obsessive threatening, menacing. If you disagreed with him, then you would associate you with racists, that, oh yeah, you are agreeing with racists, that's why you don't want to agree with me. He was suffering from very extreme and extensive mental illness that interfered with his mental functioning as a defendant. The ultimate break came when he accused us, his attorneys, of staging a phony incident at the Nassau County Jail so the jail would be locked down so that Colin Ferguson would be unable to go to his eye doctor appointment so he would go blind so he would be unable to identify the actual Caucasian shooter. And at that point we realize that this is not a man who can contribute to his own defense in any meaningful way. We realized that once he started accusing us of plotting against him, uh, that we were going to get fired and he was going to represent himself.